let's paint to de-stress go grab some paint some canvas and let's paint you guys honestly i'm stressing out because of financial issues that's going on and my anxiety is currently kicking in and this helps me for some reason because of that i know i'm just worrying about what can happen there's, there's really nothing i can do anyways let's get to this painting because why not so i got kind of like a brown and a red i also got some like bright color because why not so at this point, I totally forgot to show you guys all the colors that I used. Now the gray accidentally spilled and I was like, hey, you know what? I could do this blow art tech night. Why not? I ended up using gray, white, gold kind of ish. Did I say red already and white? That was basically it. And I did two canvases at the same time because I kind of wanted to have like that cool artsy effect. And yes, you guys, I'm doing some TikToks slash reels because your girl is getting into the game. If you guys have not followed me on Instagram, hey, it's Jules Juliet, you guys follow me along. Excuse me. Now I started doing the blow art technique, and honestly, that is too much work. I do really love the pour art. Instead, it makes it a lot easier. It's more kind of like organically, like the paint flows where it wants to flow. And honestly, it does some badass art. So now this art is actually more of an inspirational art. I ended up using yellow, red for Mackenzie, lime green for um Jake, and I also went ahead and tried to do some teal. Now, this art honestly inspired me from the Humble House. I did not meet Jasmine. Basically, this is everyone who I met at ZHC when I was at their video. So if you guys have not seen that video, it's at the end of this clip. Now, mixing these colors are definitely one of the hardest things to do because trying to get a good consistency and trying to get a good color is a little bit tricky on this end. So now we're going to mix the pink, which is Michelle. And I love how bright and bold her hair is. Honestly, pink is my favorite color to dye my hair with to begin with. If you guys have not dyed your hair, what are you waiting for? Dyeing your hair is so easy. Just bleach it and get a color. You will never mess up. And at the end of the day, your hair will eventually grow out. Or you can just go dye it at the color you have it previously. So I just found out I was not recording any of this. So let's continue. Typical Jules. No, the camera stopped recording. You know, after like 30 minutes, it stops. Anyways, but I just started going stacks on stacks of different colors Try to see where what looks good. At the end of the day, when you're doing pour over paint, you guys, it doesn't matter how you layer this. I think they all come out beautiful. And I really want the pink to pop out the most. I did not put a lot of red because red pops out so much. So I definitely did not put as much red, but I was doing the edges a lot more. Um, something I did learn about pour paint is that you must cover to your edges. I tried doing the blow, but it sucked. So I was like, you know what? No, I'm sticking to my OGs, which is a pour over paint. And just look at it. Just just look at it do its job. Using up the pour method and just moving the canvas around does wonders. And it looks so beautiful. Can we just see this? Like, it literally does its own magic. Like, look at this. Look at this flow. It does its own magic. It's so freaking beautiful. I love doing pour over paint. And it definitely does calm me down when I have my anxieties kicking in. And this is how the paint came out. Honestly, guys, um, I did use the clip that I recorded on. So look at this. It's officially fully dried. Can we just see, like, look at that, those bright colors. We have some yellow. We have some pink. We have some teal. We have some red. Look at that. And then, of course, we made a... Let's stay. And, of course, we made a smaller one. We made a dark greenish one. But then we also... This is the red one. So look at those red ones. Like... You can see that a dot of pink right there from that canvas actually fell in it, which is okay with for me. And this is a little weedy one, you guys. Honestly, this really for some reason calms me down on my anxiety. It's just like creating something different, something weird. No one has these except me, you know? It's just my unique little piece of land. Anyways, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Let's flip it over. I hope you guys enjoyed this video and stay tuned for more videos, you guys, on this coming up week we're gonna be doing the coffee videos you guys i'm obsessed with coffee and i went to the best place to go see if we could find some coffee you guys i live in california so if you guys recommend any coffee shops for me to try out that you think are better or are the best 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 to the best let me know in the comments down below i'll love to see your coffee shop bye